when it comes to wedding dresses, some brides know exactly what they want. Ball gown. Ball gown. Ball gown. Ball gown. I like it. Two piece, sparkle, glitter. My wedding is the only day that I can wear a ball gown and get away with it. Big dresses. <laughs> can stir up big emotions. <laughs> Amazing. When excitement turns to tears. I don't have that feeling. I have a hard time seeing past this. Can the consultant save the day? I want to put my clothes back on and I want to just see. Big day today. Not all ball gowns are created equal. That silhouette seems straightforward, but there's so many different elements to consider. Unless you're royalty, your wedding day could be your only chance to wear a ball gown. That's why I say, ladies, go for it. As the morning meeting ends, Christina meets her first bride of the day. Hello. Hi. Oh, hi. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. I'm Christina. I'll be helping you ladies out today. My name is Amber. I'm 21 years old. I'm from Cobaconk, Ontario, and I'm a hairdresser. Who did you bring with you? Uh, today I brought my mother, my sister Katie, my older sister Ashley, my maid of honor Jenna, and my future sister-in-law Michelle. Nice. What did you envision yourself? I am a ball gown. I want yeah. two face, yeah. sparkle, glitter, and princess. Awesome. <laughs> She's all about the bling. Yes. <laughs> okay, and what about budget? 2000 to 25 okay. is max. So you want to come with me? Yeah. We can start. So, what's the theme going to be like? So our theme is very much guns and glitter. Wow. Yeah, so my fiance Jake, he's a hunter. Oh, awesome. And very like, you know, camo, backwoods, bush kind of guy. Mm -hmm. And I'm kind of the glittery diva opposite. princess. Yeah, <laughs> total opposite. Kind of two worlds colliding into one. He is my other half. I love Jake to death. I could not live without him. What would you like to see yourself in? Tool, lots of sparkle, lots of glitter. It can't okay. be plain. It has to have something on it. I'm definitely gonna be the glitter and guns and glitter. And I'm gonna go look for some dresses. All right. And I'm back. Okay, awesome. Great. Okay. So I have my orders from the bride, princess, and bling. So, I like it. Okay, but? I don't know. I think I have to see it on. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. Amber steps into a lace and organza satin A-line by Stella York. All right. Turn around. Have a look. Aw. This what is pretty. Saying? I like it. It's nice. It's really nice. Yeah. Where's my waist? <laughs> <gasps> Okay, that's beautiful. Let's work it, Amber. <laughs> Do you have the guns and glitter feeling in this dress? I don't know. I like it, but I think it could be poofier. The ball gown has to have that poof. If that doesn't have that poof and that sparkle, I don't want it. I think it needs to be a little bit more poofier, a little more princessish. I do like it for the first I think dress. It's a good start. It's a yeah. good start. I don't think it's there yet. Okay, okay perfect. So we'll try on the next one. Yeah, okay, perfect. Cool. Thank you. Across the store, another bride arrives in search of her perfect ball gown. Hi. Hi there. Hi, I'm Rania. I'm Kathleen. Hi, nice to meet you. Welcome to Magdalena's. My name is Kathleen. I'm 28 years old and I'm from Scarborough, Ontario. Who did you bring? I brought my mother, Marion. Hi. My sister, maid of honor, Melanie. Hi. My future mother-in-law, Tess. Hello. And my future sister-in-law, Tracy. Oh, perfect. Now, what kind of style are we looking for? I want a ball gown. I like the sweetheart oh. neckline. Okay. But if possible, I'd like to be covered up a bit. Okay. I'm for church. The fabric I would like, um, something airy, something with Again, throw me in the skirt. Okay. Okay, perfect. And what about your mom? Oh, just a little bit of bling. A little bit of bling. Okay. okay. What kind of budget do we want to stay within? Uh, between 1500 to 2000 All right, so I'm going to take you in the room, and we're going to do some more talking. Great. So, Kathleen, tell me about your fiancé. Uh, his name is JR. We met in nursing school. What attracted me most is he's just a funny guy. His sense of humor is amazing. He is the most caring person. I just love him so much. And I'm just so happy to be able to spend the rest of my life with him. That's really sweet you, Karen. Yeah, that's beautiful. All right, so I'm going to go do some shopping for you, and let's see what I bring back. Great. I'm looking for something with the sheer... Ooh, look, I see something. So it's got the, the sheer neckline, because she wants coverage. She's having a Catholic wedding. Oh, I got one that has an illusion neckline. This might be a little too much, but, I mean, it's on the hanger, so I guess I'll give it a try. All right, Kathleen, turn around. What do you think? <laughs> no. I hate this dress on me. I feel like I have, like, shoulder pads on. <laughs> it's like the football players. I do not want to show my family this dress at all. This is definitely a no No, no. No, sorry. No. This dress is not a yes dress, but it tells me that. Illusion neckline, it's a definite no. Come back. Hi. Hi. Hello. I love that. Sweetheart. Sweetheart. Scent belt. Yes. And sparkles. What do you think? Sparkles. I like it. Yeah. Turn sure on. Kathleen steps into a sparkled tool ball gown by Casablanca. Oh, I like 
like this one. What do you think? I love it. Yeah. I like the sparkles. I feel princessy. And we can always like create that, that sheer top mm -hmm. that you're looking for? Yes. All right, let's go and see what they have to say. Okay. My sister is the voice that I'll be listening very closely today. You got the two hearts in line, you got the belt and the skirt. It's like, that's everything. Melanie will tell me how it is. She's very blunt. Like, I really like it, but it's still not like, oh my gosh, that's it. But how do you feel in the dress? I feel okay. I don't have that feeling. You don't have the wow factor yet, right? It's the first dress. If my sister doesn't love the dress, i most likely say no. Let's go. Coming up, Kathleen's ball gown fails to impress her entourage. It's just too plain. And for Bride Amber, bigger is better. What is smoked? <laughs> Kathleen has Rania searching for a ball gown that will fulfill her bridal dreams. Hello again. Hi. I'm back. Oh, that's different. Isn't it? It's got the ruching. Yes. That's a nice embellishment. Yeah, the back is gorgeous. And there's no buttons going all the way down. Oh, I like that. That's nice. That's Put nice. it on? Yeah, I do. All right. all right, ready? Ready. Turn around. Oh, okay. How do you feel? Speechless? Yeah. yeah. Do you think your sister's going to like it? We'll see what the reaction is. Kathleen steps out in a crystal beaded organza ball gown with straps. Different. It is different. Yes. I'm very impressed with the back. That's why I was looking for a button that would straight away. Yeah. The back of it looks better than the front of it. It's just too plain. Oh, you think it's plain? Yeah, I think it's too plain. It would look better strapless. Right. Let's move on to the next dress. Okay. I'm feeling a bit discouraged. It wasn't the wow dress I'm looking for. Christina is looking for a dress that matches Amber's personality. She wants to look like a big glitter ball. Okay. What do you think? I don't know. I don't think I like it. This is nice, yep. but I want something coming down. Okay. It's not making yeah. me go, uh, Okay. Amber has a very specific idea of what her guns and glitter dress is going to look like. No. No? No. <laughs> Poofy, princess, and bling. No. I just feel like it needs more on the bottom. I want to see... Hello, ba bam, poof. Time for Christina to call in reinforcements. Hey, Rochelle, what do you think of this one? Yeah. This might be the one that has a lot, a lot of poof. Okay, Amber, are you ready? Yes. Holy. <laughs> when it comes to poof, that is poof. Poof. Yes. Well, let's put this poof on. <laughs> this dress has a lot of bling, it has a lot of poof, and it's definitely a princess gown. Turn around, have a look. Holy. Oh, this <laughs> Oh my god, this is beautiful. This is what do you think? Huge. <laughs> Not many people can pull this dress off, but Amber definitely can. Oh my gosh, look at that. Okay, Amber, let's show them. <gasps> yes! <laughs> Amber shows her entourage a drop waist organza ball gown with pickups. This is totally the poof. It's amazing. This is definitely the glitter for the glitter and guns. The poof is you. That's, yeah, it's definitely poofy. You wanted Cinderella? That's Cinderella. My entourage has this big, huge smile on their face, and they love the dress, and I'm just feeling like I need to like this dress. I absolutely love the poof. Like, I love the top, love the poof, but I don't know about this part here. Do you see what I mean by that? I don't know how I feel about Like, I feel like I'm playing with this a lot. I'm not getting a feeling of how they're feeling, and I feel like I'm letting them down. I have a hard time seeing past this. It almost feels like a layer that just should okay, be so there. Okay, so customize it. Let me see where I need to get this off me. I'm getting stressed out. Let's go try on a different one. Okay, Amber. Let's try again. I feel at this point Amber is starting to feel discouraged. Are you overwhelmed? I just have a hard time visioning what things would look like, so that's I don't want to spend all the money to find something that's not going to work. Let me get you some tissues. I feel bad for her. I mean, no bride should have to go through this. She really wants that experience where she can find that one and only dress, and sometimes it's, it's too overwhelming. I am I'm ready to walk out. I want to put my clothes back on, and I want to just leave. Coming up. It's all hands on deck to save Amber's appointment. Relax. And in alterations, will unexpected tears flood the bride's fitting?
bride Amber has tried on a ball gown that has completely overwhelmed her, and she's ready to call it a day. I want to put my clothes back on, and I want to just leave. Do you want to talk to her? What's happening? I'm not finding anything that's working. I am starting to really lose hope at this point. I just want her to be happy. I want her to have the dress of her dreams. It's okay. Relax. I'll get Amber through this and we can hopefully move on. If only the second dress. I'm sure we must have one more here that maybe will be it. Right? You've only tried the two dresses on. There must be something that goes while I like him. All right. Take a breather. Get it together. Yeah. Get another yeah. dress in here and walk and yeah. Three times is the charm, right? Yeah. I am ready to leave, but I know deep down inside I need to find a wedding dress. Don't worry, there's lots of dresses. <sighs> As one bride takes a deep breath and resets, in alterations, another bride hopes her fitting is drama-free. My name is Diana Katsouris, and I'm 28 years old already. I can't wait to see my dress. I brought my mother. I also brought my sister. And then the third person I brought is my best friend, Stacy. I just love them all to death. Can't believe it. It's crazy. My fiance's name is Kristen Matroski, and we have been dating for almost seven years. Our wedding will be our seven-year anniversary. Chris is amazing. I wanted someone that could make me laugh for the rest of my life, and he makes me laugh. 24-7. Hello. Hi. Hi. And you do the bright yes. have to do the fitting? Yes. What's your name? Diana. Diana, nice, nice to, to meet you. you. Okay, you ready? Yes. I have been dreaming about my wedding since I was a kid. I just can't wait to wear this dress. Are you ready? Yep. Look. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, okay. <laughs> big, big dress. Yes. I always thought that the day of my wedding is probably the only day that I could wear a ball gown and get away with it. So pretty. Are you ready? Mm-hmm. Turn it on. <laughs> oh my god, I love it. Oh, it's so pretty. I'm gonna get choked out because I love this dress so much. I love it. <laughs> ready, mom? Yeah. Okie doke. <laughs> so beautiful before. That's beautiful, Diana. I know these are tears of happiness for my sister, and I'm just, I'm so happy that she could share this moment with me. Oh, look how stunning. It's so pretty. <laughs> she loves it. I love it. My fiance, he's going to cry. He wanted me to be happy and to find my dress, and I found it. Out in the racks, Rania finds a helping hand in her search for Kathleen's perfect ball gown. This one here, I love this. It's really clean and classic, and maybe she would like that. Hello. Hi. Yes. What do you think? I like this one. You want to put it on? I want to put it on. All right. All right, turn around. Oh, I like this one. I love the silhouette. I love the ruching. I feel great. She has a big smile on her face, and that's what I'm looking at. It's slim fitting, it has the neckline, just enough laying on the belt. And I like the, the corset back, too. It's really nice. My sister looks gorgeous in it. Would you want me to put a mail on? Yeah, yeah. that's yeah. 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 Okay, okay. Yeah. Oh, my God. Oh. Once that veil is placed on my head, I just knew that it was the one... That me is crying. <laughs> Kathleen, Hi. how are you? I'm, I'm good. I'm in tears. <laughs> you are absolutely beautiful. I love the back. I love the belt. I would like something to cover my chest and my shoulders. Okay, I know just the thing. A bolero. You put it on for the church, you take it off for the party. I like it because it looks like it's part of the dress and it's just enough lace. This is definitely something I can work in church with. How about an earring? Yeah, so, sure. Oh, you want, yeah, darling. Like... I just want a little bit of sparkle. It's going to come right up to her face. Oh, well, that's, that's so pretty. Sweet. So, Kathleen, are you saying yes to the dress? I am saying yes to <laughs> Kathleen says yes to a $1,500 tool ball gown with soft ruching by Stella York and rings the bell for good luck. <laughs> I think Jared's going to think that I'm the most beautiful bride. <laughs> I have my dress. 
Amber's appointment is still in danger of going sideways, so Christina looks for backup to help her find the perfect princess dress. What's going on? So, she's kind of a bit overwhelmed the whole process. Because she likes the tool. What do you think if we were going to the tool? Yeah. And this will give her great lines. And also behind me, I have this one. She wants to look Cinderella. She definitely will with it. Amber? Yes. Okay, so I brought two this time. Neither of them are going like, wow. No? No. She definitely is bringing me bling, but I need glitter. Like, I want to get that feeling where I can see it and be like, that's it. How can we help you with that? Can I go look on the racks? Maybe maybe what I'm trying to explain to you is not, not really coming out. what I'm actually wanting, maybe? I don't know. I, well, we'll find out. So, let's yeah. do it. Coming up, Amber gets into gear. Ball gowns are all here. If she doesn't find the glittery ball gown she's after, I'm still not seeing my vision. Her chances of saying yes to a dress may go up in flames. Bride Amber hasn't found the guns and glitter ball gown she's after. Maybe what I'm trying to explain to you is not, not really coming out. She hopes a trip to the racks will help her strike gold. Ball gowns are all sheer. Okay. This is so, like, <laughs> so much. <laughs> Amber had this strict vision in her head, and she couldn't really tell me about it. See this? Love this. But when she sees it, she knows it. I pulled it off the rack like it was my dress already. Let's Good do it. Good job, again. Come <laughs> see you smile. Yeah. 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 So I'm very excited to see what you think and what you chose. Oh, I love this one. Do you feel like a princess? Yes. <laughs> okay, ladies, you ready? Oh. I'm in love with this dress. Oh, I know. Into something positive. <laughs> no, you're not. No. <laughs> yes, I am. This dress is definitely guns and glitter. Spark queen. Mm -hmm. This fits everything that I've asked for, and this is my wedding dress. So, are you saying yes to the dress? I'm saying yes to the dress. <laughs> says yes to a $1,700 sequin embellished tool ball gown by Maggie Sotero. I feel absolutely amazing. I can just glide across the world. <laughs> the special day has arrived for bride Diana, oh my God. who is ready to step into her dream dress and walk down the aisle to be married. wnetwork.com slash cs to the dress canada when it comes to wedding dresses some brides know exactly what they want <laughs> ball gown ball gown ball gown i like it two piece sparkle glitter my wedding is the only day that i could wear a ball gown and get away with it big dresses <laughs> can stir up big emotions <laughs> amazing when excitement turns to tears, I don't have that feeling. I have a hard time seeing past this. Can the consultant save the day? I want to put my clothes back on and I want to just see. Good morning, ladies. Good morning. Big day today. Not all ball gowns are created equal. That silhouette seems straightforward, but there's so many different elements to consider. Unless you're royalty, your wedding day could be your only chance to wear a ball gown. That's why I say, ladies, go for it. As the morning meeting ends, Christina meets her first bride of the day. Hello. Hi. Oh, hi. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. I'm Christina. I'll be helping you ladies out today. My name is Amber. I'm 21 years old. I'm from Cobaconk, Ontario, and I'm a hairdresser. Who did you bring with you? Uh, today I brought my mother, my sister Katie, my older sister Ashley, my maid of honor Jenna, and my future sister-in-law Michelle. Nice. What did you envision yourself? I am ball gown. Ball I want gown? Two -piece, yeah. sparkle, glitter, and princess. Awesome. <laughs> oh, she's yes, all about sure. the bling. Yes. <laughs> okay, 